tomorrow. Tomorrow's my birthday, but uh, close enough, I guess. Anyway, are you ready? Are you ready to not? And get ready. Let's see if this actually works. Oh! Don't you love that sound? Classic stuff. So this is Half-Life. If you've never seen it, come on. How? What the heck? So we're just gonna go right in. In fact, actually, buh, 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 buh. training room. Training room is canon. The hazard course. I don't know what's called training. Woo! So, this game came out uh, and five years the after Doom. The hazard course, where you will be trained in the use of the hazardous environment suit. Thank you. Oh my God. The, the stereo direction is so extreme. Stepping into your suit. Oh man, you this is not designed for headphones. If you see one of these buttons, press it, and I will... Gotta get that suit. Welcome to the -E Come on. Open the door. I know. Moving around in your HEV suit can be slightly disorienting. So this is the tutorial room. It uh, I just only play it because it's technically canon and it shows like why does Gordon have the ability to use all these guns and stuff? Like why does he know this? It's apparently standard just training because you just to do science at Black Mesa you have to do this. Thanks, Kleiner. Which he's live. Like this why is <laughs> I've got a hollow doctor, you know, teaching me how to do stuff here. But... Oh, you can make me do the duck walk! So, who here hasn't played Half-Life? Show your shame. It's alright. Thanks, Einstein. <laughs> That's supposed to be like, quote-unquote, stealth. There's, there's no reason for there to be stealth in this game. I don't think stealth works, exactly. Like, stuff has basic AI. Like I said, this is five years, 1998, so five years after Doom. And, uh, it's very inspired by Doom and Quake. So we've had a bunch of boomer shooter requests on here, and I do enjoy me a good boomer shooter. Nice I figured, you know what, I'll start with possibly my favorites of Half-Life 1. Uh, I do prefer Half-Life 2, but it's kind of just barely a boomer shooter. Is the audio driving anyone else insane? I think, I think it's just how this game sounds in headphones. I'm sorry if I'm like super fast, by the way. It's, that's just how stuff was. It's kind of still how Half-Life 2 is. I presume Marathon? Uh, is Marathon on PC? Oh, this thing! Shoutouts to this thing that <laughs> they, <laughs> you don't use this until like 12 hours into the game, and I don't, I don't know if it ever tells you how to use this again. Um, probably the worst feature in the game, <laughs> like the first control feature. It's just kind of there, but um, good for speedrunning. Oh! Oh, the reverb! I love that reverb! Why does it sound like that? It doesn't sound like regular, like... The, it's so weird, but I love it. Open source and can change all three to huh. yeah, I never played Marathon, because I never had a Mac. Uh, I had... I had whatever Mac had Zoop on it. Also, one of the main uh, hints of this being a boomer shooter is, look at this. There's no run button. There's a walk button. So how about that? Some, you know, you gotta be stealthy, as that one guy said. Can I go, Gina? Is this Gina or Cross? They reused her model. I've never played Half-Life... What is it? Uh, I almost said Fusion. It's not Fusion. Um, this Uplink, which is the demo, which I also haven't played, actually. I just had the real game. Um, to spin that bridge, walk up to the control pick wheel up that and can. press it's, the it's not quite a pick-up-that-can moment, you know. Half-Life 2's tutorial is Fantastic. a little bit better. Oh, wow, thanks, Doc. You'll need to rely on more than just your suit to get through it. Oh, puzzles? This was huge. This was like, holy shit. Everyone was like, holy crap, Half-Life has the best what physics in any video game. So I do want to make sure you know, like, at the time this came out, this game looked amazing. It still looks pretty if good for its age, but way, keep in mind, you're seeing amazing graphics. Do not forget that. But the thing about Half-Life's physics is that Half-Life doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't really have physics. Everything is kind of predefined. Oh, right. You can actually pull them out, which this is, like, almost never useful in-game. I have no idea why that's even a feature. Pushing stuff is sometimes a thing, but... Yeah, the, the four directional moving things and this. Oh, that looks so good, doesn't it? It's all predefined, though. Oh, and you can break things! Oh, breaking things in video games is so good. Break, crouch. 
all the letters, by the way. Count how many letter deaths we get, because they will happen. For the next area. Thank you, HEV suit lady. Get used to her voice, by the way. Is there a G man poking in? No, I'm just warning. Look how even they turn out the lights. Oh, yeah, the flashlight! I forgot. Uh, this was way, way, way before good flashlights in video games. Um, it's not quite Doom 3, but it's Remember your flashlight quite bad. Power, so switch it off when you don't need uh -huh. it. So this is probably one of the most iconic weapons in all video games. Welcome it looks kind of like a range, goose in the original graphics. A weapon, <laughs> it, it only barely resembles a crowbar. It's very Please shiny for some reason. Like, what? The firing station. what? Look at how shiny. I've never seen a crowbar that's like shiny. It's certainly not a used one. I have no idea why they give you this much ammo for this, by the way. Breakable, non-breakable. Like, did you think this is OSHA approved? Like, they just gave me grenades. <laughs> they just gave me 500 grenades and said, hey, go go get him, kid. Go at him. Do you think this is kosher? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The tutorial is a little slow, I will admit. Man, I had... <laughs> I took a nap just before the stream, which is the best time to take a nap. So I'm a little bit disoriented groggy, but I, I forgot my meds this morning, so I'm, and I... I guess my meds work, because I can tell, because I feel like crap if I forget them. Ugh. You're so fast, kids these days. They don't know. They missed out. Man, I've been playing Crisis, and this is like, oh my god. You don't have to use, like, a meter to be able to run. Oh, man. Crisis? Uh, I've been playing the Crisis Remaster, by the way. Got him. Ugh. Crisis is nothing like this. It's not quite a bad game, but oh. Zoop. Water underwater, look at that! I think build ancient games let you go underwater, but look at that beautiful animation. That one frame of animation she did. Swim up to hold for air. You will see the blood oxygen indicator on your suit heads up display returning to its previous level. You are free to swim that sound is ingrained the end of the in everyone's course. head. And it, if it isn't yet, a lot of sounds will be ingrained in your head by the end of this. Still haven't played blood. We will get to, to blood. Raises our resident uh, blood propaganda artist. For the video game, obviously, but also the fluid. This is the charging unit for your oh hell yeah! When you are running low on I love how they reuse that little like go here, idiot sprite. They use that in uh, opposing force. Like it's some kind of creature question mark that like summons a portal. Just this is safe too. I mean, it's demonstrating a hazard suit, but still, OSHA. Very OSHA. It's a good shooter don't hear about painkiller. I've never played painkiller either. I didn't so I the first time I had a quote unquote gaming PC was for Half-Life 2, in fact. I did play some games without a real GPU before that. I had do I had shareware too, which most people did. Like I didn't have the good versions or the good ones. Who is your gaming hear me out? I'm, I'm not sure what that means exactly. Is this not King of the Hill? Oh god damn it! I fucking hate Twitch so much. Uh, Half Life. If anyone sees me do that, uh, Half Life One. Uh. Yes. Change. I fucking hate Twitch so goddamn much. This is partly my fault, but mostly just because I don't use Twitch all the time. But the VOD is now permanently just chatting. Like, the, the VOD never realizes that you changes it. I hate that. Hi, Barn. Let you back into the transit oh, wait, is it F6? Why do games do that? Why is it F6? And, like, that's... I hate when games do that. Let me change that. So I just downloaded this fresh, so none of the settings are, like, right. Um... Wait, so... Oh, I thought, I thought C was crouch. I hate when games do that. Uh, where is quick save? Oh, because screenshot is F5. Okay, I don't... I don't need it. I don't need it. Uh, quick load, F9. I hate it when they're, on, when they're on the same block. I always hit them on accident. Anyway. On your tombstone. <laughs> Barney, no! <laughs> this, this thing's pretty good at keeping me safe, actually. Damn, Barney. You guys make good suits. Oh, all right, there, I'm dead. <laughs> if you look past the mass murder, <laughs> hatred is not important. Hey, guys, am I supposed to be in here? 
And I just like, what are you doing here? Do you just sit here watching me all day? Kleiner, what is this room for? What, what, is, <laughs> God, what is this? If someone explain to me what this is. It's graphics, that's what that is. Hi, Kleiner. No! Make me do this. <laughs> hey! Okay, can I just continue? Am I supposed to be doing I completely forgot what I was supposed to be doing. Barney. <laughs> Barney on Barney violence! Man, like I said, this HEV suit is really effective, isn't it? Alright. What was I supposed to be doing? I think I handed my guns and stuff to these guys. Got my gun and my badge. Oh, you can move the chase! I forgot. This, I, I don't believe there's any reason that you need to do this in the main game. Because it, like, sucks as a feature. But you can do it. Sure, I'll follow you. Oh, I stole him. Uh-oh. I think I... <laughs> did I softlock okay, by stealing him? Here. Oh, no. He just goes over. Yes, I will follow you if you Alright, so this is the follow me sure, tutorial. I'll follow you. Can you let me through? Uh, Bart. Barney. Barney! They're waiting for me in the test chamber, Barney! <laughs> Barney, no! Barney catching incredible fucking strays. <laughs> Bar <laughs> what is your Barney? I'll follow you. <laughs> this is the obliterated Barney for no reason. So this is a coat, a coat rack. I understand that, just barely. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. I like a key hanger thing. <laughs> Alright. Press, press forward key. Oh man, there's a whole thing of this. <laughs> this is so crusty, I love it. There's no reason for this to even be a feature, but there's like a, a whole chapter or two that's based entirely around the bad controls for this. Come back anytime. Certified for use of the All right. HEV Mark IV protective system. Anyway, if I if we're streaming on Twitch and I haven't changed the damn thing, uh, sure. Let's play on hard. Um, if we're playing something on Twitch and I haven't changed the title, any mod, please change that for me. This automated train is provided for the I've never done that on purpose in my life. The hey, there he is! So that's the real Barney. That is canon Barney, by the way. There's many Barneys in this game, but that one is mine. 47 a.m. Keep in mind, this was eye-blowing. This was mind-blowing, even. Look at Barney run! Look at him go! Zoop! The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. It's handicap accessible, and it was like 1998, so you know, that's like, wow. This train is inbound from level 3 dormitories. So keep in mind, your mind is being blown. The graphics are amazing. Just keep, just keep that in mind. So this, this whole intro is like, holy crap, graphics. It might look a little bit crusty these days, but trust me. That there's a warehouse. How big do they estimate this facility is, by the way? Black Mesa is completely ridiculous in scale. The entire game takes place in this goddamn place, and you never see quote unquote the exit. That will unfortunately cause other games to copy without people understanding my half life. It definitely was a big game changer. What would you say the next game changer after this is? I would say Call of Duty is a bit late. Material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound. No smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. I'm sorry if my, if my mouse movements nauseate you. That's just that's just gonna happen. I I I have been playing Crisis on a controller and I feel so free now. I I am I'm a new person right now. At the station platform. Also, no subtitles. Like I said, 1998. No good accessibility. Hey, helicopter! Look at that shit. Where did Barney go? They're so fast. That's how you you know it's an older game because like people move so fast and things are like convenient and enjoyable. Yeah, that's that's not how you spell quote. The U usually goes after Q. Did I miss a certain person? By the way, I think I missed G Man. I think he's at like the very beginning or something. We'll see him anyway. The size of a moderately sized national park. That sounds about right. So look at that shit! Graphics! Oh, 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 oh! Yeah! Beautiful. 
imagine playing this immediately after Doom. That's not quite... When did Blood come out? It was a few years. I mean, you know, games were 3D. Uh, what came out in 1997? When was Quake? Like, 95? 6? I didn't have Quake. Like I said, no, no GPU. Hey, that's me! That's us! Gordon Freeman, male, age 27, PhD, MIT, in theoretical physics. Gordon Freeman is the only goddamn video game character I know the the major of. Duke 3D was 96. Blood was 1997. More lives than your own may depend on your fitness. Kleiner, Kleiner, there's a lot of people getting locked out, and a lot of very unsafe-looking things. Disaster response priority discretionary. Oh, guess what? That's a reference to. And low clearance security. Hell yeah. No person on the train, no wheels. But you, it, you can tell it's a train, though, and that's what matters. So yeah, Duke 3D 1996, two years after Duke 3D. So yeah, that should kind of cement in your brain that, like, this is pretty nuts. <gasps> oh shit, oh fuck. Republicans, please leave the stream immediately. This is a DEI video game. There is, like, one black person in this game, so... Screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa was a Research strong year for game. Golden. Oh yeah, Gold Knight. So that's a great example. Obviously a console game, but get out of the way! Hey, hey! If you feel you have We're on the tram. Sure. <laughs> why is this allowed to happen? All why is that allowed to happen? That's Does it that doesn't seem good. I'm I'm not a degree I don't have a degree in nuclear physics, just Your theoretical physics, but theoretically I'm not sure that's supposed to happen. Could be wrong. Now arriving don't worry, we're we're almost done. Test labs and control facilities. Yeah, 97 was a great year in gaming. Eight, I think. Did Final Fantasy VIII come out this year? It was either Final Fantasy VIII or Final Fantasy VII. Mega Man games were old too for the classic. Please stand back from the automated door and Mega Man doesn't feel old. Mega Man is just always Mega Man, identity. you know? It just always comes out, or it used to. Be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe. The one slow Barney. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. Doc, it's Doctor. I didn't go to seven years of evil medical school, or I mean regular theoretical physics school to be called Mister. Damn that ass on Barney. Look at that. That's this is not really an ass, is it? That's just kind of a a backwards fupa. Is this on making you uncomfortable? Am I, am I creating a hostile work environment, Barney? That's good because it's kind of canon that Half Life is, or that Half Life, <laughs> that John Half Life, main character of the Half Life series, is kind of a dick. Mega Man only truths feel old in the intro sequence in case the gameplay gets. Oh yeah, 20, 20, 2000X. The f distant future. It's amazing how it took games like 20 years to stop using 2001 as like distant future. <laughs> Like, there's stuff in the 90s that's like, wow, 2001. Like, everyone in the 90s expected us all to die in the year 2000, apparently. Hello. Here it is. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but I had a system work. crash about 20 minutes ago, and oh. I'm still trying to find my files. Who, Just one of those who runs this place? They were this problems <laughs> down in the test chamber, too, but I oh, think that's shout out to Sector C. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Oh my God, hey, stop are you that. doing? <laughs> Come on, Gordon. You're so, one of the biggest things about Half-Life when it came out was the level of interactivity is just nuts. You can do all of this stupid stuff before the game has even started. Get away from there, Freeman. <laughs> I'm expecting an important message. What is this? Do you get calls on that? Even glasses again. <laughs> Some guys, someone's hidden Kleiner's glasses. <laughs> Are you sure you check Where the could they be? Attenuators? Kindly lower your voice. I can't be bothered right now. You'll just have to wait until after the test. You kind of get the vibe that nobody likes you here. Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy now. Please, leave me alone until after the experiment. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber half an hey, hour ago? Hey, 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 well, the tram was late, maybe. Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy now. I'm at, is there a canon explanation for why he's late? Can we do this later? 
Sorry, I'm on duty, Mr. Freeman. Hey, catch me later. I'll buy you a beer. Yeah, that's the line. You'll just have to wait until after the test. All right. I like that they have the. This is like real. Um, I am rather. You know, research college. campus stuff, and I guess college too. Hey, it's um, Magnuson, kind of. I can't be bothered right now. Please leave me alone until after the experiment. I can't be bothered right now <laughs> looking at his crotch. supposed to be in the test chamber. How do you make them say shut up by the way? Leave me alone until after the experiment. I'm 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 creating a very hostile at work environment right now. Until after the test. Can I jump on his head. I love it in games where you can jump on people's head and like kill them. Which I mean kind of probably would happen if you jumped on someone's head. Like humans are heavy. HR department. <laughs> We don't have one of those. Actually, no, we got diversity. Here. Excuse me, Gordon. We got one black guy. Now. We didn't get a different voice actor for him. Right now. The sample was just delivered to the test chamber. So, oh. This guy's the one guy that's not mean to me, him and Barney. Are you 100% sure that theory of yours is correct? Of course. I'm a theoretical physics. I I make theories. Absolutely Probably. Until after I'll kill me, please. Ah, it's good to see you. Big day today, Freeman. Big day today, Freeman. Good morning. Gordon. Imagine, imagine your coworker walks in and he's just like walking around, bumping into people, and never says Any anything. He's, he's doing this and looking at people's Hank Hill asses. I saw it. Look at this. You can tell Kleiner is a real brainiac. Look at that. Don't you think we should recalculate those resonance dampening factors again? Oh yes, of course. Science. Science terms. Do you have any science you know, to say? You repeat yourself sometimes. <laughs> do I? See, that's that's canon like suggestion that I do say things. By the way, like I don't, I don't think he's genuinely mute. It's just he never. They kind of lampshade it in the later games by making him like, oh yeah, you're quiet you talker. Supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago. Hey, I'm here now, buddy. Excuse me, Gordon. But I'm rather. <laughs> Everyone's so upset with you. Hey, there he is. <laughs> Look at the model sliding down. That's graphics. That's graphics. I'm sure that. I'm sure that doesn't matter. Let's just ignore that. What do you think that is? Oh, coolant reserve facility. You got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. <laughs> Barney's with- I love his Barney's with attitude pose. Sorry, guy sir, on. I've got to stay at my post. Look at those teeth! Hey, catch me later, I'll buy you a beer. Yeah! Can we do this later? Yeah. Look at the reflection on his hat, by the way. It looks terrible, but like, at the time, it's like, wow. Just like those reflect. I honestly really like the terrible reflections in, um, Ocarina of Time. They look so unrealistic, but it looks so cool, right? Gordon Freeman has a rich singing baritone voice. Can, can I get in here? Oh! He just walk into the door. <laughs> get fucked. Now you have to- My god, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Einstein doesn't care. Einstein is capable, you know, he's got night vision. He specked into that. You should have done that, Eli. So Half-Life is one of the best games in terms of like, they, they make retcons really work. This is what laptops were gonna be in 1998, by the way. This is what they were gonna be like. See, it's it's at least it's flat screen. It looks like Minecraft. I can't be bothered right now. <laughs> Guys, he's doing science. This is what science is. I can't be bothered right now. You can tell it's really science because there's like faded marks and they don't know how to like clean their thing properly. Give me a quote. Fine. All right. <laughs> I promise we will play the video game eventually. It's just every I think everyone had to do this. Like if you just go straight into Half-Life. Greetings. You... Please leave me alone <laughs> until after the experiment. Wow. Okay. No smoke. The whole facility is no smoking, idiot. Anyway. Oh, hi, Eli. Oh, oh. Oh, hell yeah. This is canon, by the way. Ah, oh my god. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> So this is canon. If you don't do this in your Half-Life speedrun, uh, your run is not valid. Your run is not canon yes. to the Half-Life universe. This all looks nominal. <laughs> <laughs> in the break room. Ah, yes, this all looks nominal. You can actually heal. I love when games let you heal. It's like one HP, but yes, you can heal from drinking pop. I love stupid crap like that. Oh, it's grape! Soda, soda pop. As I expected. <laughs> you, you expected me to nuke your casserole? You'll just have to wait until after the test. 
Now that is graphics. That is coffee. Look at that. I, I kind of love this kind of stuff where it's like it's just fun. What is that texture? It's got writing on the coffee cup. I love this. Like you can just barely tell what Aren't it is. Level to be in the test chamber half an hour ago. It's like you can tell what it is. Stop modeling. Just do it. Hope oh. those containment parameters are still nominal. <laughs> now, I just the, the the break room is nominal. We just heard that, Mr. Bond. Do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties. Yeah, he said it. Oh my God, this there's so many good lines in this. Theoretical limits. I'm an expert in theory. Uh, I have a theoretical degree <laughs> in looking at scientists' asses. These are apparently names of uh, where is it? Oh, that's me. Yeah, I got a creepy science battery in here. A baby. People theorize to that to be Alex, but that's just kind of a baby. That's just kind of in here. Um, Mandela. Mark Laidlaw. <laughs> Putting himself in as a reference. Uh, the Orchid Eater. I can't use that now. Um, isn't Gay Ben in here? Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous <laughs> ties? I thought Gay Ben was in here. Birdwell. Um. Oh, there's Laidlaw. Why isn't Gaben in here? Oh, hey. <laughs> Am I making a hostile work environment? Guys, it's gonna be half an hour before we like actually have a gun, and I'm totally fine with that. You just had to do this shit. It's like, like, you know, interacting with the strippers in Duke 3D. It's required. <laughs> the water graphics are particularly nice. Look Someone's at that. Hidden my glasses again. <laughs> All right. I love that this Einstein. So this Kleiner. There's four different scientists modeled. There's Magnuson. There's Kleiner. There's Eli. And this guy is just straight up Einstein. Excuse me, Gordon, but I'm rather busy I'm now. Like this. All right. All right. It's officially a video game now. This is a UI. Oh yeah, he does have a ponytail. Oh, you said pony style. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? Level. I'm gonna turn her up a little bit, actually. Uh, audio, HTV suit. Communications interface online. Have a very safe day. Thank you, suit lady. I'm sure we're gonna have a very safe day. We're wearing Excuse a very safe me, Gordon, suit. But I'm rather busy now. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber yeah. half an hour ago? I love the kind of implication that nobody likes Freeman, so that's why he got the duty of what we're about to do, which is very scientific. If you've never seen this, well, there's gonna be a lot of science happening. Looks like so. you're in the barrel today. <laughs> See, the way Barney says that, like it's not a good thing to be in the barrel, right? <laughs> All right, Barn. Pull me through the airlock. I love these things. Black Mesa. This was well before. Message for Captain Black, Command and Vacation Center. Why do we have a Captain Black? Safety! We've seen a lot of safe things today. We're gonna have a very safe day. Freedom. Black Mesa Security Force. Freedom. America. God bless America. Hydroelectric Dam. Why is- why is our work advertising our work? In our work? Like, what, what are these for? Helicopter. It's fucking attack helicopter! You need- that's important for science. Satellite deploy is nominal. Working as a team. You know, diversity is happening. So the, I guess it's America, so there's, you know, army helicopters in our medical or science facility. Let me see if I can catch this. Oh, oh I automatically catch it right. How do I... Oh! Oh! <laughs> Imagine... <laughs> Imagine Gordon Freeman. He, the dude shows up 30 minutes late to work. Everyone's waiting on him. He sniffs everyone's ass. And he falls down the world's most unsafe fucking elevator. <laughs> it's like, God damn it. Why do we hire this? He's got a... F Are you sure he has a real PhD? 
Our company, our office is filled with huge print out of ads of our own software. <laughs> Good. All right. This is this is safe, by the way. Have a very safe day. This is an even better elevator later on. That does an even better, even safer thing. I mean, it's got a guardrail. God forbid you actually enclose the structure. That's stupid. You don't do that when science is involved. I guess. He looks like such an evil scientist. <laughs> well, don't, don't, don't make me. You'll just have to wait until after the test. <laughs> Fucking inflection of that line. Oh, the ionization chamber is very important. Plasma cells. Oh, laser, laser tube. You gotta have a laser suit. Mysterious Please science. Leave me alone There's weird sounds. So you can tell the science is about to happen. There's the science. There's the tube. You gotta have tubes, obviously. If there's no tubes involved, is it even science? Half-Life, it's him and Eric production. Oh, oh. Ah, Gordon, here you are. We just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we need the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather they went to some lengths to get it. Oh, I wonder, I wonder what We're happened. waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. <laughs> They're so mad at you! They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. I really doubt your readings for a change. So, other than Barney, I don't think it's really canon which model. So, in later Half Life games, each. Oh, I love when you can, like, see things, even though it's, like, one minute away. But I love Do you know who ate all the donuts? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know who ate all their. Shut up! <laughs> Eli, did you eat all the donuts? <laughs> Guys, that's that's science. That's just a giant fucking left-handed keyboard <laughs> that he pushes his little meat hands on. That's how I play this game, by the way. <laughs> Guys, someone please clip that. Do you know who ate all the? Shut up! <laughs> oh! It's a oh! To go critical. <laughs> What the hell is going on with our equipment? It wasn't meant to do this in the first place. Just regular science. Very good science happening. You know, <laughs> Aperture is like wacky shit, but you kind of get a vibe in the first game. You know what? Oh, by the way, amazing elevator. Very necessary. Whoop! <laughs> it goes down like five feet, and it has to do that. Very necessary. Test lab. I can't be bothered right now. Weren't you supposed to be in the test chamber half an hour ago? Hi. Please, leave me alone. <laughs> There's so many me! Test lab C33 divided by A. Pick the best healing item. Soda, water from broken toilet. Oh, I love my games to let you drink from the toilet! I can only think of how, um... Oh, by the way. Classic Half-Life shit. Fucking... Oh, this doesn't have the nice stutter that Half-Life 2 does. The little, the loading. At least it's fast. I'm it's afraid we'll be deviating a bit <gasps> from standard analysis oh, procedures yeah? today, Gordon. Oh, really? yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. How'd you and get it? Potentially the most unstable. Oh, really? Now, now, if you follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I'm all about I don't inserting. Know how you can say that? Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely. What, what's unlikely. a Resonance Gordon cascade. Need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. That is true. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Ah, uh, yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete <laughs> confidence <laughs> in you. Well, you <laughs> is something wrong, Magnuson? I love the fucking <laughs> sex vault unlock requirement of the two. <laughs> you need two scientists to unlock the anti mess spectrometer, which I guess is like the closest thing to a real security precaution in this entire fucking facility. I, I kind of, when I first played this, I, I just kind of, I didn't quite get it. Like, well, I guess it was before Portal, so I couldn't have, but, you know, Aperture Science is, like, wacky and stupid as hell, right? Um, Aperture is canon to the Half-Life universe, by the way. The Borealis was supposed to be the start of Half-Life 2. So Black Mesa and Aperture exist in the same world, and Half-Life, for Black Mesa's not that much more secure than Aperture, is it? They're... they're they don't have C Cave Johnson, but otherwise. You know. 
At least we're a highly trained professional. We know how to handle giant computers. Testing. Testing. <laughs> Everything seems to be in order. Should I be in here? Is this... All right, Gordon, is this gonna do something to my sperm? Why do you do that from in here? You have an entire ass control room right there. Okay, I love how it like it doesn't have the scientists loaded because like that was too much to handle for your PC. Maybe Black Mesa. You need sperm. Gordon, are you not hearing me? <laughs> Start the rotors, please. <laughs> they hate you so much. I just love the the, the vibe between Half Life One where everyone's just kind of pissed at you and like. Like, eh, fucking Gordon. And then in Half-Life 2, you're like the freaking messiah. Which, considering what happens, is pretty reasonable. Ass control room. What's a resonance cascade? You guys, you guys didn't explain that. Is that bad? Alright. All right, I don't think I should be in here while this happens. That doesn't sound like a sound that you should be hearing. By the way, get you... <laughs> Place your bets for how many ladders kill me. Ow! Power to stage one in three, two, I didn't. I didn't mean for that to hurt, but yeah, the fall damage is pretty nuts. All right. This, are you sure I'm supposed to be in here while this is happening? I'm sure. I'm sure they need me to do a highly technical task. All right. Secondary emitters. So we're gonna do some very important science. There's a very valid reason I'm in here. Obviously, these are scientists. All right. Beam propaganda directly into your ass. All right. Why can it even do that? Probably. I love how Kleiner does this again with the fucking rocket in episode two. Alright. Alright. I love how the cart is like a robot. It's like an E.T. robot. Alright. Alright. We have to do science with this. You look at that Zen crystal there. Alright. Let's do some science. Let's... let's. Alright. Can I... Oh! I can't pull it back. Ha ha! Ha ha! Alright. You know, I've never waited for them to bitch at me. I'm gonna do that now. Oh! <laughs> Nothing to worry about! What, what was that about a resonance cascade, guys? Like, what, what percent chance do you think that's gonna happen? Like, zero? One? All right, all right. Science! Oh dear! Why am I in here? I just pushed the cart! <laughs> Kleiner, no! God damn it, you told me there was a very low chance of this happening. I was specifically told that this wouldn't happen. I love how you you're I have a theoretical physics degree and I push a I push a rock <laughs> from a cart into a giant murder machine. <laughs> oh no, Doug, I'm I'm joking. So obviously a resonance cascade would not happen. This is zero percent chance. It's very unlikely. It's very unlikely that this would happen. This is this this is just science, alright. Listen, sometimes. Only voice effects of Gordon in the entire series, by the way. You can hear him breathe. Well, fortunately, we prepared for unforeseen consequences. Is that, is that supposed to be doing that? Like, do you think these rays are good for my, like, my sperm? Do you think this is fine? 
<laughs> it's fucking good cinder blocks. There's just cinder blocks in the ceiling of this anti-mass spectrometer. Oh, Magnuson's fucking dead. Glass breaking, there's blood everywhere. <laughs> full life consequences. Man, we gotta watch the full life consequences. Like, Barney, no! Listen, when your work is this unsafe, they have to train everybody how to do this. Oh, I'll eat that, thank you. Oh, wow. Only 10? Seriously? Oh, maybe that's because it's on the hard mode. I'll probably regret that, but you can change difficulty. Barn. Oh, oh, there he goes. His eyes were open the whole time, but you know. 1998. Too much. <laughs> Beautiful animations. Ha! <laughs> Real human. Love it. Okay, we might live longer if we work together. You go on without me. Okay, why not? Okay, I'll wait here and help anyone else who comes by. Let's get the hell out of here. See you later. Yeah, we might stand a better chance of this. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait. Okay, I'll cover you. Oh, yeah, let's go. I'll do that. Let's run like hell. <laughs> I love that one. All right. Oh! Explore. Gibbs! So Half-Life 2 is not quite so, like... It's still pretty gory, like there's horrible burns, like skeletons and stuff. But it doesn't have the like gibs. It doesn't have the quake kind of violence like this does. Come on, Barn. Can he even follow me into here? No. Of course he can't. Alright, doors. Yes. Hi Eli. Why Good. didn't they? I to warn them. <laughs> I never thought I'd see a resonance cascade, let alone create one. So I was Gordon, I was told this wouldn't happen. Thank God for that hazard suit. I'm afraid to move him and all our phones are out. Please get to the surface as soon as you can and let someone know we're stranded down here. You'll need me to activate the retinal scanners. Oh, I'm tutorial sure the, time. the science team will gladly help you. I love how there's more computer inside this computer. Just in case this happens. Which... Yeah, I wonder what fucking asshole started this. Haha. -ha. Right. I love how he just said, like, <laughs> oh no, we caused a residence cascade. One second later, who is responsible? There's a lot of generic lines that are pretty funny. You guys sure got blood everywhere, like, good god. Are you, you, you're not coming? Oh, by the way, hello. Just look at that. <laughs> Interesting! Just l look at that! Wow! They're already bloody, by the way. Look at that. Oh. They just come pre-bloodied, I guess. That's actually a pretty good look at the underside. You don't usually get to see that. Alright. I'm sure those won't try to eat our face. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Thanks for blowing open the door, I guess. Go, 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 go! Alright. <laughs> so over a half hour in, like 45 minutes in, we don't have a weapon, but that's fine. Oh! Oh shit! And we're gonna need a weapon. Oh! Oh, it's slippery! I forgot about that! There's water on the floor, so it's slippery. I always kinda like it when games introduce the first enemy. Oh my god, the laser tube! The laser has escaped the laser tube! Son of a bitch. Oh no, no, not, not Barney! Not Barney, no! Look at that. Yuck. Poor Barn. Eh, there we go. I always kind of love it when games give you, you know, your first enemy encounter without a weapon. So you're like, oh shit, oh fuck! Give you that sort of panic. In case of fire. You know, I did that too earlier, so. Can't blame me, guys. Common mistake. Co you good? You guys good? You okay? Well, there's, there's no... Oh! Oh, there is a ladder! Okay. I'm <laughs> save before using ladders. Alright. Is everyone okay down here? You good? Oh. Yeah, take a salt tablet. That'll, that'll buff right out. Oh, hey! I'll eat that. It's alright. 
So I have a theory about Barneys that I didn't get to last time we were watching the Barney, or the Barney, the Half-Life memes. Uh, so there's so many Barneys, right? Oh, wow. Oh shit, that kind of sucks, actually. I, I shouldn't have let that happen. That guy's a... What are these things, and why are they wearing science team uniforms? He's supposed to win that fight, but hard mode. I love they just kind of lay down. They don't really do this small thing. As well. Oh, yes! Oh, I love that glitch. <laughs> Sorry, Barn. At least I got my gun, though. Alright. Helicopter. But yeah, there's so many Barneys in this game, right? And so later on, they retcon Barney into a real character. Which I, I keep forgetting to say. Good. Um, Half-Life does some really interesting retcons where it makes generic NPCs into real people in later games. Um, so Barney becomes an actual character. He's just kind of the generic security guard in this one. But my theory is that every time a Barney dies, their spirit goes into the next Barney's. So right now the Barneys are weak, but by Half-Life 2, Barney is incredibly strong, right? So every Barney that dies in Black Mesa becomes stronger in the Prime Barney. It's like the conservation of Nimpo thing. America. <laughs> just as... <laughs> Guthrie just... <laughs> What kind of serial killer just has absolutely nothing in their locker except a giant American flag? Like, you know, I, I love my country and stuff too, but <laughs> nothing else, just flag. That's all he needs. All he needs. Angry German kid. Shout out to Angry German kid. That's all. Oh, oh no, Bajee Man was over here. Oh, <laughs> Head crab looking for that ass. Attention. Am I not gonna heal? Oh, did I pass the thing? Was there a thing? This one is gonna stare at the 4th of July. I like to imagine whatever scientist just goes in there and just like looks at that for like freedom. Every day he has to be reminded of freedom. chat for the casserole. It somehow survived better than most of these scientists. <laughs> what, the, what even happened? What? How? Keep in mind, this is... Well, I guess it, I guess we don't know how long we were stuck in the portal flux. But, like... We're, as far as we can tell... Oh, there we go. This is the bathroom. I don't want to know what's inside here. If, if you need... The health dispensary in the bathroom. Man, science. I love science. So the original Half-Life was actually even... Like, the beta Half-Life was even more silly and much more Quake-inspired. I mean, not much, but like... The models look so silly, like, uh... The scientists are like mad scientists, even more so than Kleiner looks like now. And the Barneys look like terrified. Oh! Every time! Every time! I'm sure that's why it like, you know, saves here. Head crabs used to have asses! Oh. See, look at that interactivity. I, I didn't even know you could do that. Ow. <laughs> I, should, <laughs> I should probably turn off hard mode. Things really hurt in this. Wow. Um, I have I have not like practiced before this, so I've I played Half Life a couple times. But where? Uh, can I set that? Oh, I think that might be a Half Life Swords feature. Uh, oops. Oh well. We've got quick saves. So we'll be fine. Man. Alright, let's just. Oh, come on! 
Whoa. Like I said, dude, there's gonna be some sound effects that will be ingrained in your brain. At least there's the light for some safety. This room is very safe now, thanks to this, you know, safety light. Oh, hold on. Is it like a console command to lower the difficulty? Because I didn't realize you couldn't change it back in the original one. I thought you could, but that must be a Half-Life Source thing that they added later. Oh! 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 Yeah! Yeah! You got him! You oh! oh. <laughs> Load-bearing scientist. Oh, this is fucking creepy. So it's mostly like, you know, almost goofy stuff, but this is like fucked up. He's just... <laughs> he's watching some YouTube poops. It's just gonna put you out of your mystery. Oh, they don't do this anymore either. The, the skull imprinted on the head crab. I guess it makes the head crabs feel like too thin and weird, but very creepy. Science things. You good, Barn? <laughs> Managed to die the second I get into the room. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, hard mode is harder than I remember. Usually those things give you like up to 50 health. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Sound doggos. Oh! It's a blueberry! Raspberry. There he is! There he is! Who's that mysterious man? Sad boys. You good? <laughs> now that's graphics. You good? You need... You okay? <laughs> so he's supposed to get pulled into that vent, but... I don't know, it may be a bug in the Steam version. I can't find my, uh, the CD key of my Half-Life Generation thing, so I just played the Steam version. Does anything have, like, a bigger discrepancy in how it sounds versus, like, the actual danger of, um, uh, Hound Eyes? They, they, it sounds, like, so extreme, but it's just like, yeah, it's like 10 damage. Saving all this hard difficulty. Death. This sign, that sign should just be everywhere at this damn facility. That, that should just be on the front door. Just death. This is, this is like the nuclear storage room. Oh. See, stuff like that is purely scripted, but stuff like that is like really cool in Half Life. It was very like, wow. You can do things in this video game. Have a little bite of Eli. Alright, alright. Danger. Got oh wow. I was wondering if that would be a bad idea. Oh grenades! Oh, I need a science man. Are there any science men around in here? You! Fine. You won't even know I'm here. <laughs> I don't suppose you reconsider. I certainly hope you know what you're doing. I'm I'm a highly trained professional. All right. Come on. So they mostly got rid of this in like the uh... one of these blood samples under a microscope. <laughs> I love when scientists in video games are like, "Ah, oh, yes, yeah, that's nothing to chaos theory." <laughs> And especially that, I love when they're just like snide bitches. Like that's what real scientists would be like in this situation. Thanks, buddy. Lead the way. I'll stay here. Yes. I'm slowing you down, am I? Yes. But why are you leaving me here? <laughs> Sad boy. Glad to oblige a fellow. Have I been that much of a burden? With my brains and your brawn, we'll make an excellent team. Well, I seem to be seriously wounded. <laughs> I forgot about that. Bill, 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 Bill. 
I think I hit like a, a, a brain nerve. I gave him a lobotomy. Sorry, man. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, there he goes. There he oh, goes. No. Oh, no. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Oh, no, he scared of me. I can't imagine why. My brain's in your brawn. I'm a, I'm a scientist man, too. I know how to do science. Look at this. I'm about to do some science. I'm gonna science this hound eye. Oh, head crab. <laughs> I forget about this guy! That's you are going to have to leave me here, Gordon. That's I'm going to stay here and wait for my colleagues. Yeah. I refuse to go another step. Leave this is as far as I go. <laughs> Dumpster man. Nice. I refuse to go another step. Yeah, yeah, you just stay in here. Clarence level four. Just little hole. Oh! Head crab hole. Oh, oh, oh shit! Oh. I hate to do this. F in the chat for the first Vortigon. Oh, gun bullet. Why is somebody. There's just ammo around in this facility. But then again, there's, you know, Apache helicopters and crap, so. Bye. You just need this. You gotta go in the sewers, get some poop on my nice hazard shoes. See, this is what the HEV suit really is for. Because sometimes in Black Mesa, you gotta go through the sewers to get to work. Considering what we saw in the intro, that, that doesn't seem. Oh, oh! Oh, the poop flow was very nice today. Why is that? Why is there? There's a feature of this grate to just do that when it opens up. Well, Duke Nukem is an alien species of duck goose that can steal his brain. So apparently, win award in humanity. Yeah, the original Duke Nukem games are very different from uh, 3D and beyond. All right. Here's our first cool trick. Speed trick. Oh, oh, it's too speed. We went too fast. The QPUs. We're too intense. All right, let's try this a, a bit. No, you gotta get on this. There you go. Because you can slow yourself down because of physics. This is this is not regular physics. This is theoretical physics. Only Gordon knows how to do this. Gordon is very powerful. He just went into the box. That's cool. <laughs> I hope you love the gib sounds. <laughs> Just a rain of head crabs. You're supposed to be attacked by head crabs on that thing, obviously. Isn't nature beautiful? The head crabs are heading upstream to spawn. Is that like infinite head crabs? Okay, no, it stopped. Burp, 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 burp. Stay in your box. Oop. Oh! Ow! Oop. So another thing separating Half-Life from more modern shooters, it has a lot of platforming sections that make you die. Another reason I probably shouldn't have put it on hard mode. Is there a console command that lowers difficulty? Because I, I might need that at some point. Hard mode. I I think Half-Life 2's hard mode is pretty pushover. I think that's what I was thinking of when I put it on hard. Lower canal. A man, a plan. Lower canal. To go to lower canal. Got any items in there? Oh! I love when alien critters just do alien. <laughs> alien critter things and like predate on each other <laughs> that's so ridiculous I love <laughs> spin kick. wow both spins can take a lot of abuse they sound so sad when they die oh now here's the poop water That's a good sound to make in the poop water. That's the sound of Gordon just slurping up the poop water to strengthen his immune system. Somebody didn't use the health thingy. Oh my 
god, that's so annoying. <laughs> Each one has like 10% health. Please look friendly. Wait, wait. I'm fine. I am now the I'm the Barnacle. Oh. For a brief moment I was the Barnacle. I just love my HUV suit detecting major lacerations. Post mortem lacerations, of course. I was about to do the crouch jump thing, but no. I don't get that yet. <laughs> OSHA approved. You gotta filter the poop water with a giant, like, murder machine. You can make them eat grenades. Uh, you definitely can in Half-Life 2. I'm not sure about this one. Let's find out. I have some grenades. Grenades are terrible in this game, so I never use them, so I guess we may as well. Yeah, that's just a half life two thing. The, the physics don't really exist. There's some scripted interactions and stuff, but it looks a lot more advanced than it really is. Well, platforming time. I remember doing it in one. Maybe snarks? I love in games when you're so fast that you can just quote unquote jump by just running. Doom is kind of the uh, progenitor of that, because it doesn't actually have jumping. But with running really fast. By the way, if the graphics are off putting, uh, don't feel bad about playing Black Mesa instead, but I really would recommend playing the original. It's, it's a really important piece of gaming history. That was like my play the original when possible. You might need to cheat if you need to, but well of course you need to if you need to, but a safe elevator. Strange. Maybe we all have to wear these ridiculous office complexes. If you get it in the mouth oh it doesn't catch it on the tongue, okay. I don't know if we could do that with those ones. You you good? You good? <laughs> I love the little environmental like puzzle things and like <laughs> stuff like that and it's like yeah these things are dangerous poor scientists in this game there will be so many dead scientists <laughs> noises Noises of this game are forever embedded in my psyche. Ah yes, reverb. Barney, no! It's not what reverb sounds like. Alright. Oh, there are cockroaches. They're like one... Look at that! They're like four polygons. Is there any sane reason to be in here? I'm so glad they don't do this to you in Half-Life 2. They don't really, like... They don't attack you in the narrow corridors. We be gamer. Oh! I think a later version added that where it's an instant kill. I think in the original it took multiple hits, which is very dangerous. Could be wrong. Sweet soda. Imagine... Oh my god! Nightmares every night. H how long have these been? <laughs> like, we. <laughs> I love that they're so low poly, they look like alien things, but I'm pretty sure they're just supposed to be cockroaches. Oh, I left them free. Oh, God. Kill them. Kill them all. Um, those must have been here before, because, like, it's been like 10 minutes. Well, more like a half hour, but it's all. I suspected this could happen, but the administrator just would not listen. You suspected this could happen. 
Do you, you 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 specifically suspected this would happen? I mean, you are an Einstein. If I'd known it was you, I'd have let you in. Everyone's heading for the service, but I think they're crazy not to stay put. Someone is bound to come by and rescue us. Oh, oh that, yeah. I'm sure that'll With happen. My brains and your brawn hey. will make an excellent team. Hey, you want to know what happened? Last guy who said that. I'm going to stay here and wait for my colleagues. Bro. Bro, careful, careful. Alright, turn that off. Yes, let's go. Bro. Alright. Alright, so that's off. Why does Steven let you? Oh, that turns off the fan. <laughs> you good? Yeah, he's good. He's fine. We get a break. Can we show that image I sent? Uh, what image? I don't see an image. Oh, is it in Discord? <laughs> oh, why does it do that when I just drag stuff directly? That's so stupid. Oh, it's because it's in the temp folder, I think. <laughs> if you don't play Family Guy, you like Meg. Meg, you like Meg. Meg likes Family Guy. If you like Deltarune, play Undertale. Oh wait, no, no, no. Wait, where did the scientist man go? Oh, glad to oblige a fellow scientist. You're going to have to leave me here, Gordon. <laughs> All right, that's how we get in here. Sorry, Barn. There's gonna be a lot of Barney violence, unfortunately, in this. Say it, boys. Man, Barney. You gotta, you gotta do something about them lips. Those are very pale lips, Bar. Oh. Um. Uh, what are you doing here? I don't actually think there's a reason to be in here. Um. Every time a Barney dies, that's one less beer that we get, so we gotta be careful about that. <laughs> the reverb is so weird. Okay, where am I going? Oh, am I supposed to like use this to go up here? I think I get stuck on this area every single time. <laughs> Indeed. Yeah, I definitely get stuck here every time. What, what do I do here? I always forget what to do here. Oh! I could have sworn that was like unbreakable glass. It looked like reinforced. It does less damage than I thought it would. Even the head crab is fine. I've never seen a video game... Like, usually, electricity stuff in video games kills you instantly. Turn off the beam faucet, idiots! Ah, uh, yes. I have this in the, uh... Whatever room this is. You good? Hey, hey, hey! See, look at that. React, you know. Uh, interactivity, that's what I'm saying. So. Oh! See, hate that. Hate that. I think it's the only Half Life game that does that to you. Like, come on, man. What the fuck is that? Oh! That's what the fuck that noise is. Okay. <laughs> Oh, hey, that was my own skull! Did you see that? <laughs> Alright. Keep crouching. I love when games do stuff like that. 
Half-Life's always had a really good sense of humor. It's a little bit more toned down Half-Life 2, but it's very, it's still got, it's still got a good sense of humor, it's just more subtle about it. So these cockroaches, unless this got teleported in from Zen, these cockroaches were already here. Which again, unsafe work environment. Barn! Ooh! Hell yeah. Sir? Sir? Oh, barn! Barn! Whoa. That was close. <laughs> yeah, it was barn. What <laughs> is that smell? What is that smell? I don't know, barn. Posturing. Oh, come with me, Mark. Yeah, we might stand a better chance if we team up. <laughs> One less horror in the world. Super dramatic, Barney. All right. Uh, there's only certain crates that actually have items in them. It's the ones with the green tarps. So you don't need to bash open all the other ones. I think in Black Mesa they no longer allow you to kill random scientists, so that's one unusual thing compared to the later game, so I'm not gonna do it because I love these characters mostly. But uh You can totally just do that in the original Half-Life. It's very <laughs> whale mouth. Um It's kinda strange to go back to, but this was very much originally inspired by a bit more edgy oh. See, look at that! It's totally scripted, but isn't it neat? Breaking the glass. Where did Barn go? Barn. Barn! Okay, I'll wait here and help anyone else who comes by. Let's get the hell out of here. You good? Open the door. There we go. Ah, oh, yes, minor lacerations. Ah, yes, graphics. Two of them are graphics. Bullets everywhere. Uh, you don't know where to I guess this space is ridiculously huge. Oh, oh, I remember. This is the. Oh! Synchronized head crabbing. Majestic. Barn. Head crabs don't walk on two legs anymore. Head crabs used to be a proper country. Return to traditional head crabs. So you do do the pushing stuff a little bit. I hear you pricks. Oh, physics. Real physics. Just like real physics. Oh. The ladder board. Oh. <laughs> like I said, real physics for real people. Uh, so you go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, you can't you can push it. Okay. So that's what we're supposed to do. On the left, Gordon. Gordon, baby. Oh my God. <laughs> Gold source ladders are the absolute worst. This isn't. This isn't even a dangerous one. It's just annoying. There are later ones. Like I guarantee, I will die to the one um, in the outer space octopus room. Ooh. <laughs> Freeman. Okay. What is the purpose of this device? Like, come on! Like, come on! You know, it's the secure- oh! Shooty poop. Yeah, you handle those. No friend or foe? So this is what AI is gonna be like. I love the little shortcut opening though, you gotta appreciate that. 
when we give everything over to AI. Damn it. It's gonna be exactly like that. Oh my god, this is all still alive! <laughs> oh, stairs, steady there. Hey, Gordon. Barney. Roger that. Let's run like hell. <laughs> Love that one. Greetings. Greetings. A failure of this magnitude is extremely improbable. <laughs> You're telling me, Doc. Oh, right, they can heal me, can't they? <laughs> it's like the fifth time they've used that animation, more or less. That is TVs. That's real TVs. Look at that. That's some high tech TVs. High tech pimple chair. Oh. oh! Oh god. Oh my god. I'm gonna I'm gonna check. Uh half life console change difficulty. Uh console up skill issue. <laughs> skill two. One is for easy, two is for medium, three is for hard. It doesn't. Is it supposed to like give confirmation? Oh wait, uh, SV cheats oh, one. Okay, let's go to. Uh. Maybe it's just skill without a space. Oh, it's. I think it's working. Okay. There's some real anomalous materials going on here. This is... These physics are very theoretical. What do you think about this, Barn? Okay, I'll secure this area. Okay, we might live longer if we work together. Are you sure, Barn? Teamwork doesn't seem to go very well in this place. <laughs> they love... They were so proud of the Gips, Ray. Alright, alright. This part sucks. Die! Oh! You know what's ridiculous? People play Brutal Doom to like reload in Doom. Like, not having to reload is like one of my favorite things. It's just. Doom guy is too cool to need to reload. The, the guns just work, you know? Sorry, Vorks. Oh. Again, theoretical physics. These are some of the most theoretical physics I've ever seen. Which HP did I have? Let me get hit by one. Okay, I think we're on medium. I think video against meeting someone's around the corner with a nice shotgun less. No, we should do that. I do have a shotgun. What? What? Oh, I was inside of a head crab. Oh, Bart! Barney! Barney! The hell, bro? Barney just popped a cap in my ass. Barney is somehow still alive. Bring it on! A lot of shotgun ammo. I should really be using this one. Again, boomer shooter. It, it actually allows you to have reasonable amounts of ammo. And by reasonable, I mean unreasonable. Reasonable gameplay-wise, unreasonable physics-wise. See you later. <laughs> Barney! Something died down here. Barney! Barney! That's not fucking funny. Party <laughs> fucking asshole. Shut up. Something died down here. <laughs> you know, I'm. You go first. You go first. Be my guest. Right, he does. They're very specific about following you. It really means follow. Alright, let me just go this way. 
of, of all of the ways to die in this. Aliens and shit are happening. Oh, so sorry, Bart. You, you kind of deserved it after that, you know. That particular barn, ow. Kind of deserved it. But he died by a lamp falling over. So many vorts. We have, like, already killed more vorts than exist in Half-Life 2. Why does that keep happening? This guy just died of, like, sadness. Uh, he just fell over. He's just dead. Oh, yes. Earth. Oh, you can hear the Vort speak. It sounded kind of like Freeman. There's an ammo cap until the hardest difficulty in Marathon. Huh. Talking about war tests. But where are they? Die! The shotgun is not double barreled, by the way. There's some questionable weapon decisions in this game. Ooh! Like, the game developers, not uh, gun makers. So many vorts! Are we sure this still isn't on hard? Because that's a lot of vorts. Just down like five pops. Imagine just like... You are from the Anomalous Materials Lab. Yes, I recognize you. Is that really important right now? It appears the containment system has completely failed. Yeah. yeah I think it did. Fine. You won't even know I'm here. Fighter. Right. <gasps> no! Oh my god! Alright, sorry, Kleiner. Yeah, there, there will be more Kleiners, it's alright. Hey, Gordon. I'll be happy to survive this with all my parts. Hey, what the hell are you doing down here? Get topside! I hear troops are coming in to save us. Oh, cool! That sounds good. Get my hands on the guy responsible for this place. Yeah. What kind of douchebag would have started all of this? There's a dumbass with a ponytail. That's now that's ladders. That's what ladders look like. Valve. Hey! You can't do that. Self-promotion. Here. Can we watch some of the aggressive scientist videos? Um, maybe at the end. I want to at least get to the HD, uh, either two hours in or when the, um, the Marines show up. I probably won't stream super long tonight. My brain's kind of frazzled for a moment. Not closing. I, I don't feel. I don't entirely feel like my meds are working, but according to my like survey results, they seem to. And also, I can really tell, and I haven't taken them in the morning, so I guess they're working. Hi, Barn. Yeah, let's go. Five second rule. That's that's gross. It's gross. Stop it. My 
right ear loves his pistol. Loading hallway. Oh, reverb is gone. <laughs> Just harvesting the <gasps> valve coffee. Oh yeah, can I get an espresso, please? Fresh brew. Sake, open the silo door. That's in a bit. I believe the silo door is a fair bit later. This guy's got some moves. Magnuson. Magnuson's doing a TikTok dance. Look at that. Sorry, Magnuson. I really can't tell if one. Is there some way to confirm difficulty? I guess we're on um, physics, by which I mean slightly sliding this. Oh yeah, can't you like feed the, the bull squids? Like, splat the meat. Why do, we have a giant, why do we have a giant meat locker? I guess, I guess there's a lot of scientists to feed. You know, feed to bull squids. That's so silly. Come on, eat the meat. Tia eats the meat. I love stupid crap like that. It feels so real. I think head crabs taste like crab. They do eat head crab. You can see them. It sounds so sad. You can see them cooking a head crab in Half Life 2. He died like he lived. Nothing. That seems safe. I think I'm supposed to pause that, yeah. At least this Barney is well preserved. Wait, what the Oh, no, I can't turn it off. Okay. It's not it's not shutting down. It's a big ass rib cage, look at that. I don't even know. I guess that's a pelvis? Drop their pelvis. It's just a foot. Whose foot is this? That's an extra foot. Oh god, that sound is annoying. Oh, give me the thing, Barn. I've had no. I've had no battery this whole time, and I probably won't. I think they give you one. start giving you more battery stuff later on. This is still quite early. Yeah, the peculiar markings, Eli. All right. I'll be here. Yes. Yes. Look at the peculiar marking. <laughs> this door does not like me. <laughs> All right. There. It's always in the vents. This game loves its vents. I refuse to go another step. <laughs> it's like ribs attached to the spine. It doesn't quite look human, but you know. 1998 graphics. Get out of here! I hate your, I hate that noise. Now we're getting some battery. Thanks, suit. I wouldn't have known basic math if not for your help, suit lady. How many head crabs will there be in this vent? Like, it's not even like a one-off, like, jump scare thing. There really are head crabs in, like, almost every stupid event. Beautiful verb. How do they pick the bones clean? It's It's been, like, two hours. So how did the barnacles, like, magically just attach to the ceilings? 
Like, did they all get teleported in specifically to the ceiling? It's a video game, but still. Like, how do these... Are they... Do they become sessile later in life? Like, how do these things work? Like, sure, they're, they're not just born on the ceilings, right? Oh my god, the sun's back. <laughs> Sorry if my commentary's at super high energy, but again... Just... Not, not a super bad day, mostly just the... I guess my sleep... It, it suddenly got, like, summer heat again, so sleep has been slightly bad. But can't take much more of this. Hey, don't count on the cavalry findings down here. Hey! Head Barney! So we can still climb. <laughs> Fuck. One Barney dies, the other just starts capping me in the face. With my brains and your brawn, we'll make an excellent team. Yeah, I deserve that. Kleiner, it's been one. You, you've moved one foot. You climbed two steps. <laughs> Barney. Barney. Bad. Bad. You're gonna win. What the fuck was that? Hang, hang on, I have to, I have to see that again. Barney, just stay there. I was hoping he'd say like, ah, good to see. You. Fucking Mel Brooks, or not Mel Brooks, Michael Bay scientist. Imagine Bo Gordon Freeman just loads an entire shotgun, pointing it at your face, just not saying a word, like... Terrifying. Oh! There he is! Oh! <laughs> was. Allow me to treat that injury. Oh! Boop. Thank you. I'm yep. slowing you down, am I? Let's go. I forgot about that for a second. There's assorted bits of the G-Man. You'll see more of him later. I refuse to go another step. Oh, oh, oh! Whoop! Hey! Ladder, one ladder. Two ladders. By Einstein. Uh, oh, of course. Get that reverb, though. I'm shocked there's not a head crab in here. Oh, we've got hostiles. That's a strong scientist. An entire <laughs> bomb is like slowly falls over. For God's sake, open the silo door! That's voice acting in this is very good for '98. Built different. If you quick in a toast short period, the dude makes fun of you for it. I love stuff like that in games. Alright, I'm sorry, I'm lying. That doesn't seem good. Does it let me just get trapped in here? Oh no, it just goes back up. Okay. Yeah, I don't think Half Life lets you do that. Wonderful beginning in there. Oh, fair enough. Not even gonna give me a chance to like. Yep. Oh, hey, dead marine. Ass. 
Freeman, eat my ass. Not quite portal turrets, not quite. Ooh! Automatic medical systems engaged. You know what, I'll take it. Yeah, we're definitely we won't see it. So at this point, keep in mind, like, Gordon is high out of his mind on adrenaline, morphine, like, pieces of him are hanging off. He's got, like, 15 different species of blood on him. He's running around not saying a word, like, he's got to be the scariest person in the universe. Oh, thanks, thanks, computer voice. I'll definitely go do that. I'm sure good things will happen topside. my best combat slide. It's not really an intentional maneuver in this, it's just kind of how... I guess maybe it is. You do kind of go faster for the first second. I think that may just be a quirk of the movement system. Why is, why, why is this stacked like this? Doom boxes. Oh, you got a crouch jump. Let's see that's too much these days. Okay, yeah, this is definitely on e here at normal, not easy. Hey, hey! <laughs> this is just like, yeah, good luck, asshole. It's good luck. Oh, <laughs> I love this one in particular. You can actually get over this one. You know what? For old time's sake. Hello, what's up? Attention. All military personnel. Extreme atomic biological chemical alert. Extreme atomic biological alert. No! You good? Hold down, boys. Hey. Hey, there he is! To the thing. Lead the way. I like to deactivate. Sorry. My bad. My bad. Yes, sir. Power fifteen percent. Free me. You know what you're doing. I'll wait. No, no commentary. Glad to oblige a fellow scientist. I don't think that guy's supposed to survive. <laughs> Fucking cockroaches. Sorry, sorry, <laughs> sorry. Man, OSHA's gonna have a field day with this place. Good lord. What are you doing? Hey, hey, hey! Oh. Oh, hey, it's the Red Berets. Where are you going, asshole? Get back here! Go! Ass to ass communication. Ass to ass conversation. Man, the music is so fucking quiet in this game. I'm gonna turn it up. MP3 volume. You kind of forget this game has music, honestly. Oop. 
music. Pathfinder has pretty decent music, but like the music is like not audible most of the time. Turn it up even more. Like ridiculously quiet. Security is everyone's responsibility. Not safety though. Boxes. My boy's a box! Damn you! A box! This is real platforming for real humans. This is what. I love Half Life, but it's kind of. It does kind of remind you of why most first person games don't do platforming anymore. But then there's Portal, which is basically puzzle platforming, but. I didn't know you could put sunglasses on the Noel I guess it probably just applies to all of them. Oh! <laughs> I'm apparently the secondary objective, so that's cool. When half life you enter another map area, the music just cuts out. Oh yeah, the, the loading thing is very chunky. Even in Half-Life 2, loading is a PC. Yeah. Oh, is, is that why the music... Because yeah, the music is in fact gone now. I guess that's why the music is just not in. Um, this is the Steam version without any edits, so I don't... It's not fixed the Steam one. Maybe the Source one. Oh, let me make you a mod RL. Uh... Not ban, not ban, okay. I love how Twitch has the same problem. The ban button is right next to the mod button. I banned Ray's a bit ago <laughs> on YouTube, which deleted all of their comments, which was great. All right. Preemptively get rid of that. a cockroach again. We will be watching Scarface at some point. Ow. With the Discord for, um... Half-Life 2 has the same exact issue. Counter kind of low, you just stop and it's flat out. Well, no wonder there's so little music in it. I always wondered why it was like that, but yeah. It's amazing they made an entirely new engine and still managed to introduce the same bug. uncomfortable that like not only are there marines here to murder us like the computer system is like specifically designed apparently to be like yes marines murder gordon Freeman. they can't have basic safety protocols but you know, they have this hazardous machinery you don't say Games are not comfortable tapping out. They do not like that. Pop and all torture. This is your music. Man of Siri got Google in your pocket. Just like, please, please, take me with you. I'm the one man who knows everything. I'm the one man who knows everything. Oh no, they got the one man who knows everything. Where is even? Oh, oh. Let's go. Oh, god damn it.
know that. He's dead now. With you. I'm the one. Man, that guy took a lot of bullets. Don't kill me. I'm with the science team. Oh. No! Dark! Go! This was like the OG sentence mixing, by the way. The um, the Marines, the ra the reason they sound so weird is their the voice clips are like word by word, so you could like remix them, which a lot of mods do. But it feels like it must have been designed for mods. And so is the computer. In fact, you can like. Oh no. Uh, what's the what's the console command? H half. Console say. What what's the thing? Level mic. Isn't there a, a control th uh, like a thing where you can just make the thing say stuff? Military command. Yes. Squad neutralized. <laughs> hey. Not bad for 98, huh? Move in! Squad! Eliminate Freeman's ass! <laughs> Look at that! Man, games these days don't do shit that good. Look at that. Take this! <laughs> Look at They fucking... Mental. They got a lot of grenades on their asses, too. Yeah, the Marines still hold up. They're, they're still tricky bitches in this game. The AI is super complicated, but it does some it does some pretty cool stuff that makes it difficult. The command is speak. We're talking. Is there a way to do that without pausing the game? Or is there is there a command for that to use the marine voice instead of the? Um, you do need quotes, but only if it's multiple words. Apparently, is there a way to do the marine voice instead of the marine one? Nice one. She's surprisingly less interrupting than. Um, Parker is in streams usually. Outside of streams, she's an absolute nightmare. The ass squad eliminate Gordon's ass. I don't think the I don't think that clip is in the computer. No, the world. I said. The AI, the, the AI does have its, you know, mild flaws, but I mean, the Marines are still pretty good, especially for 98. Oop, oops, so, so, you, you can't, I'm, I'm not in an angle where you can really sit my lap on. Oops, so, she's trying to sit in my lap and not doing very well. It's only 620 words you can say. Not bad, oh! See, now we got some music. It's again very quiet. What? What was happening? Why did that happen? Why? Why did he not die? So I can, hear it fall. So I can feel you slipping. <laughs> so stay in your bed, please. I love that dead animation. Yeah, no shit! I don't think this game has headshots, does it? Your ass is extreme. Squad, execute extreme ass maneuvers. Oh. 
keep right clicking. God damn it. Okay. I might need to use like tactics here. Actually, I might need to use grenades. Never mind, the grenades are terrible. I, I almost, I briefly forgot. Oh, it does bounce off. I could have swore it just flopped straight on the ground. Maybe it does that in source. They got wise to it. I've, I've never seen them just set down a grenade like that. That was hilarious. I didn't know they could do that. Oh, God damn it. Like it showed me. It took a few of them, but they learned. God damn it. Oh, this shotgun is so slow. Okay, okay. Whoa! What the hell was that? Move it! Squad moves my ass into your ass! <laughs> These Marines can't cope with grenade. Nah, it's a bit early for that. The first game I played that I could cook a grenade. It might have been half uh not half life. Obviously. Um uh, actually can you? Let's see. Well, no, not like that. I think you can cook grenades. Nope. Oh! <laughs> oh, so it's one of the ones where it doesn't explode while the pin is down, but it's still... The fuse still goes. Okay. So you can. A bunch of words of Team Fortress Classic exclusive. Huh. Stereo, the Doppler effect is so extreme. Oh! You don't say! For God's sake, open the silo door! First game I remember cooking a grenade in was uh, Kill Zone One, I think. It had like a little timer and everything on the grenade. Vent access. The entire game is a vent access. Five stars in GTA be like, take cover in my ass. Hello. Just random skull. Oh, hey, 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 hey. I was wondering why you were doing that. Who put you on the planet? <laughs> Drop off two dies, guys to their deaths and just leaves. Okay. Ow. My leg! I can stand in this vent.
Treat has micro ace. I'm a twelve dumbass scientist and not one of them fall back. This sucks. So it's just to compensate for you killing humans, they kinda make the Marines fucking psychopaths. Which is very weird in opposing force, but opposing force is. What did you think was gonna happen, buddy? What did you think that was gonna do? By the way, if you prefer filters, you can put them on, but no, I don't. I don't like how filters put them on. On games that are basically pixel art. Oh, was I supposed to drop down? Attention. All military personnel. Extreme atomic biological chemical alert. I'm not supposed to be there. Is he getting lost is a true sign of a boomer shooter. That's most of what Doom is. Oh. I haven't seen these guys for a little bit. Oh, another barn. I wonder how many Barneys died in all the playthrough of this. All military personnel attacked by a logical chemical alert. Well, now we're talking. Barn! Oh. I think chat. talking. Probably will. <laughs> Gordon ass man report to ass. Gordon ass man report to ass. Oh, I forgot the, the flashlight runs out. So it has to be here somewhere, yes. If 
For God's sake, open the silo doors! No, we can't go this way. Oh! Ladder. I don't trust this. Ladders. The ladders are so good. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, thank goodness. God's sake, an hour later, the silo doors have been opened. Is this power up? Oh, last bit. Oh! Oh. Hmm. It's very important. Wait, what the fuck? Outer space octopus. Because I don't think I want to do that quite yet. It's been two hours. I think I'll probably wrap it up around here anyway. Just in case you forgot the first one. Which I don't think it's possible. Those things got some aim with that. Oh, no, no, no. Good sounds happening right now. Bad aim. Good ah! Major fracture detected. Is it a good beat? Oh. Um, is that a good view they advise us your way? Thanks! Uh, yeah, birthday's tomorrow. We're doing a PragerU watch party, or PragerU YouTube watch party. Very different from PragerU watch party. Parody stuff, not insane political stuff. Is it really necessary? Where is it? Where is it? It's on my shoe. It's in my raccoon. Oh, he's on my <laughs> Hey! Hacks! Hacks! Boop! It's just massive sticks of dynamite. Okay. You need that for science reasons. Safety, safety of the millennium. Beautiful safety. Like uh, this, this hole, these holes are very nice. 
Alright, this is our first visit with the tram. Don't worry, there's a much worse tram later on. Oh! Get in the way of the tram, please. Almost. I'm <laughs> trying to run you down. I love the few seconds when it's still alive. Oh, 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 oh. Forgot about that part. Again, OSHA approved. <laughs> this, this thing, by the way. And also this. This is good. Gotta have some of that. Hey, hey, hey. Just <laughs> slam into this thing. Come on and slam. No, I'm radioactive. That can't be good. This is the least damaging radioactive goo I've ever seen in a video game. I guess it's mostly because they have high energy. The energy really absorbs a lot of damage. Oh, good stopping point. Welcome to Japan. The goo. Wait, here's the goo. This is the goo section of the game. I'm going to eat the goo. I still need to make a short for eat the goo from Half-Life or um, oop, the goo. Resident Evil 4. You may. Take a bath, stinky. Take a bath. So does it we get the new bull squids. They modeled bull squids for Half-Life 2, but they're not in it. They're in the like beta files. Sounds like a look. Guys, I'm a total beta file. Fracture detected. <laughs> classic, classic Half-Life stuff. Put the sign up, boss. That should do it. That should do it. Oh, yeah, alien octopus is a bit later. Apparently these guys just like it like this. They just like it. Heavy <laughs> beat bats. Close enough. People ever get a Fallout game that actually lets you become a super mutant or something? I think I'll call it here. Um, last one, what's the... Oh. Are those explosives? Yes, they... Oh! It's the interactivity. Gotta love it. Let me get to a safe spot. See if there are any. Oh! There is a safe spot. There you go. Oh! Engine testing. Is this what I think it is? Yes! Okay, okay. We're saving that. We're saving that for later. Um, <laughs> I would not like to pet the peeper puppers. Alright, we've got to see the memes. Um, where? Freeman. Alright, let me. One last thing. Alright, what are these? Give me those memes we're supposed to see. Oh, no, no, not, not that. All right. Uh, did you post in the Discord or something? Uh, I was told there was memes. Where's the memes? It was like aggressive scientist. You scientists. Half-Life. 
Angry Half-Life NPCs. Is that it? Oh, okay. Uh, let's see here. Ah, good to see you. Um... This one, right? Gordon, you're over half an hour late. Where the fuck have you been? <laughs> Do you realize how critical this test is? Half our jobs are on the line and you fucking waltz in here like <laughs> it's the weekend. Why don't you take your sorry ass down to the test chamber before I crack your jaw and drag you there myself? <laughs> Pretty Most much. Of the simulation results are perfectly acceptable, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Kleiner. Klein has got my back. Ah, Jesus. Look, I've told you a thousand times before, Freeman. You can't go in here. If you make me repeat it one more fucking time, I'm going to engrave it on a bullet so it finally gets through your thick skull. <laughs> now, Barn! Off. Barn! Oh, sad boys. Oh, that's adorable. Are you a fan of Ghostbusters 2? <laughs> I built this proton pack to be as screen accurate as possible, but I just can't get it to work properly. Could you give it a try? Oh, no, 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 no. He <laughs> ass haircut. Take a look at this, Gordon. I don't know why. <laughs> Good to see you. Gordon, you lousy motherfucker. Get your <laughs> dork ass down to the test chamber or else I will shove the sample up your ass. <laughs> you stop fucking with the microwave. <laughs> Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties when you get to dress up in that sexy suit? <laughs> Qu questionable. Oh, isn't there the one where Gordon gets harassed? HL1, but all the players just really hate Gordon. Um, uh, where's the one where he sexually harasses Gordon? Oh, yeah, workplace. Yummy. Can I get a piece of that ass, Gordon? Hit me up after work today, hon. <laughs> Magnuson, that's not appropriate. Mr. Freeman, you know I can't let you through here. <laughs> Terrifying. Uh, what's this? Oh. Heart to heart. <laughs> There's a lot of these. They don't like it when you spam E. <clears throat> Wait, did this get content ID'd? I forget. One more. Gordon, eat my ass. Your ass is heavy like my ass. Who let this guy in here? Who? Uh. Whoa, hey there. I want to make a big announcement. Y'all are liking the videos and subscribing, and I think I'm starting to like you guys too. <laughs> For that reason, I want to share some big news. First, I've gained over a thousand subscribers in a short time, and tens of thousands Shut of views. Up. Thank you so much. <laughs> Shut up! It looks like a lot of folks are watching, but not subscribing. <gasps> I think it's because I just started making these videos. Remember to out of like, comment, and subscribe, haven't really gamers. proven myself yet. Well, I'm going to prove myself. Today, I'm announcing that I've started working on a script mod that will contain <laughs> unique dialogue filled with lines you haven't heard before. None okay. of the videos I've shared or will share between now and the mod release will contain any of the lines. It'll contain brand new dialogue for you all Imagine to enjoy. There will also be opportunities for you to submit lines which will be featured yes. in the mod. Yes. I will share more details about those opportunities very soon. <laughs> Second, I want to focus on quality and slow down my uploading to two to three videos a week. All right, we've... I get the picture, Mark. I've got a peer-reviewed study right here that says... Mm, says you're a pussy. <laughs> oh, one more thing. Hey, do you hear the something? The creators can see who isn't subscribed. Yeah, we, we will Hello, find your ass. Soldier, sir. Oh, this hey. sign. I thought we were becoming friends. You don't see you Otis know, for a while, but... Nobody likes a bully. Oh, I 
can't wrap my brain. Is Otis and Blue Shifter just um Yep. Nope. Just opposing force. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I love them in, in awe. Sure. Yep. <laughs> nope. Yeah, sure. The song will make you like Otis, by the way. This warning. Special occasion. I very much doubt it. Hello, soldier, sir. Fighting aliens is not in my job description. Hey, soldier. My mom is gonna worry when I don't make it home tonight. Hello, sir. Hello, It's the only good use of water, too. Hello, hey, soldier. Hello, soldier, sir. Hey, sir. Hello, sir. Hey, soldier. Hello, soldier, sir. Hey, I bet you're glad you got me with ya. Hey, I'm right behind you. Bet you. And I was supposed to play bridge tonight. Bridge player detected. You are my friend. I have a better chance with you. You are my pal. together. All right, let's go. You are my bag. I tell you what, she just love a cold beer. Well, they can't wrap my brain around it. You know, if I had one. I love that he just Minnesota Barney. Nope. Yes, sir. Okay, now see, <laughs> I'm so glad I didn't take the janitor job. Yuck. Now see, <laughs> this job is not worth dying for. Okay, now see, <laughs> uh, my cousin is the one that got me this job. <laughs> I'll stay here and pretend to guard this area. Oh, Maybe Otis. I should guard that closet. Oh no, I'm not fat. You betcha. I'm just what's called big bone. Maybe so. Maybe no. I think I got a right one. Andy, my reputation precedes me. You betcha. Maybe so, maybe no. <laughs> Stay together, better as a team. Damn! Right. You are my friend. I got your back. I got your gear. Right. You are my valley. Stay together, I'm on your side. Right. You are my friend. That's Gordon at the bottom right, by the way, with the ponytail. More of a rat tail, honestly. Yeah, Kurt Hectic is a janitor. I'm not sure if that counts as a boomer shooter, but that's I'll another. I'll get the leftovers. That's another retro game that we got to play at some point. I am a doctor. Oh my god. One, one more video. I am not a That's another game we gotta play, but anyway. <laughs> gotta play hey, do you hear something? <laughs> Hello, soldier, sir. Hey. <laughs> no offense to anyone that plays bridge, but Otis definitely looks like he plays bridge. Anyway, that was super fun. Um, bit tired today, so shorter stream than usual, but we'll keep plugging away at Half Life. Um. The hard mode was definitely a bad idea, but we seem to be doing just fine. Do we watch Half Life Full Life Consequences? It's only five minutes. I was thinking we would do like a stream where we watch like silly. It's not really a dub. What would you call that? I guess it is a dub. It's a fan. It's a dub of a fanfic, a parody fanfic. Um, I do want to watch that, but it, there should be like a special stream for it. By the way, someone please remind me in the comments to make a clip. Or a short of the thing where I die and Barney makes fun of me. That's disgusting. Also, one of the best things you can do to help the channel in general, um, aside from like, commenting, and subscribing, is um, like point out good moments for shorts and stuff. I hate making shorts, honestly. So if I know a good timestamp, at least. Hi, Parker. Parker says it's time to stop streaming. It's time to stop posting. One last. Oh, there's Kurt. It's Kurt's ass. Kurt is... Listen, Kurt was in full leather spandex then... Leather spandex, yes. Uh, before um, the, the like 2000s X-Men. Hi, Parky. Oh. Sh the kittens love Parker, and Parker just like tries to be all Tsundra. Like, Shine will like rub up against him like that kitten tail hug thing, and Parker's just like... 
he like leans back like ew. I do YouTube clips when I can. Yeah, if you do a clip, post it in the comments, by the way, because you can see if there's clips, but it doesn't email you, or it doesn't, like, notify you. So, like, you basically have to know they exist. <laughs> Jine is trying so hard to give Parker his love. Hi, Shine. He doesn't hate the kittens, but he's still a little weird about them. Anyway, <laughs> time to end the stream. Can I post Duke Nukem insulting me? All right, one last bit. Um... Remember to join the Discord and all that, sertaptap.com slash Discord. I still got to move over the URL and stuff, but both URLs work. Oh, I guess that doesn't work anymore. It should work. Dookie Nookie. <laughs> Freeman got, er, uh, Freeman got micro inches. Very good. HEV charger. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> I am the Lizard Queen! Oh my god. Cats How with Half-Life soundtracks is really so good. Just look at that. I believe this will make for a notable paper. I hear something. Hello? <clears throat> Fat lot of good that PhD does me now, hmm? <laughs> Don't get short with me, little guy. <laughs> Cat. Alright, stream end time. Join Discord, blah blah blah. Good night.